And finally, from Latin America, Argentina's President Javier Malay has announced a bold and extensive plan to establish more nuclear plants in the country. The chainsaw-wielding president wants the new plants to incorporate artificial intelligence and make Argentina a nuclear pioneer. The far-right leader says he secured American funding for the project after meeting President-elect Donald Trump and billionaire Elon Musk. We'll bring you more about Malay's ambitious nuclear strategy. Under President Javier Millet, Argentina remains on a path toward reform. The chainsaw-wielding right-wing leader has promised to transform the Latin American nation. Plagued with skyrocketing inflation and high unemployment rates for years, Millet has been quick to push through with his policies. Despite protests, Millet has slashed funding for several government agencies and public institutions. And his tactics have worked. After decades, Argentina's inflation is at a four-year low and locals are optimistic about the economy. But Millet has his eyes on a new project, nuclear plants. Millet wants to incorporate nuclear energy into Argentina's ambitions. Last week, he announced the Argentine Nuclear Plan, an initiative that would include the construction of small reactors that would also leverage the strength of artificial intelligence. Millet says the AI-based nuclear plants would be needed to support the rising demand for electricity amid a worldwide AI boom. Millet added that nuclear energy is vital to boost the advancement of AI technologies. The potential for development in artificial intelligence is so immense that conventional energy will not be enough to supply this new demand, which is why we are convinced that a resurgence of nuclear energy will occur throughout the world, because despite the countless campaigns of discredit that some international foundations have mounted, nuclear energy is the only source that is sufficiently efficient, abundant, and rapidly scalable to cope with the development of our civilization. However, Argentina will not be undertaking this ambitious project alone. Millet has requested the United States to invest in Argentina, including in nuclear energy projects. Basically, I have to tell you that we will indeed move forward with a free trade agreement with the United States. Just yesterday and today, it was reaffirmed by the spokesperson of the president-elect of the United States, Donald Trump, that we will work to achieve a free trade agreement with the United States. Millet is hoping that with Donald Trump in the White House, relations between Washington and Buenos Aires will rise exponentially. Millet not only has a good rapport with Donald Trump, but even the president-elect's closest ally, Elon Musk. Millet was the first international leader to meet Trump after the U.S. election, and he's also likely to attend the inauguration in January. The two world leaders, joined by Elon Musk, have already dined together multiple times. With Elon Musk pushing for AI with his firm XAI, Argentina could play a major role by supporting Musk with nuclear-generated power that would enable XAI's quantum AI computing growth. Millet plans to inaugurate the AI-centric nuclear plant in Argentina by 2030, and the United Nations nuclear watchdog, the International Atomic Energy Agency, has already given Millet the green light. The AI-leveraged project will utilize Argentine technology and will also aim to develop uranium reserves for domestic use and export. Currently, Argentina has three nuclear reactors, with two in Atucha and one in Embalse, and they generate between 7 to 10 percent of the country's electricity. A fourth reactor has been in the works in a joint project with China, but it has been stalled since 2022 and is on the verge of being terminated after Millet came to power and switched Argentina's foreign policy with a major tilt towards the United States. Millet says that after decades of decline, Argentina will make a triumphant return to the global landscape by becoming a nuclear energy pioneer. Millet plans to feed the AI-linked demand for energy by incorporating AI technology in nuclear plants. Will Millet's ambitious plans bear fruit, or will the Argentine president face roadblocks even before AI enters the nuclear arena? <laughs>